been uh, <clears throat> clearing and clearing and clearing some more. You can see uh, we've been all the way down there. We've still got a lot of cleanup stuff to do. we got to fall trees to uh, thin it out some more. The crown spacing is still a little too tight, um, especially over there. We've got to take out a handful of trees. Um, for fire, you want 15 to 30, even up to 60 and 90 foot drip line spacing between trees in um, parts of eastern Montana, especially on slopes. As you can see, this is definitely pretty sloped property. Um, falls off pretty rapidly down into the bottom down there. Um, drops off into the ravines and different stuff so it's kind of been working the mulcher pretty hard going up and down the hills it takes a lot of horsepower to climb the hill and run the mulcher at the same time but we're getting there i think we're at um, probably 18 of 22 acres and another 10 to go after that so. doesn't pick up coal working down there very well. camera also doesn't pick up how fast that thing is spinning, it kind of makes it look like it's slow. Spins at about 2000 RPM at full speed. Right now we have the carbides on because the ground got kind of rocky in over here. So hitting the rocks and stuff doesn't damage the teeth near so much when they're carbides. Anyway, I'm going to go fall some trees. <laughs> 